The first step in the archaeological method is background research. Here to introduce that is our expert, Xander. Today you see around me my team of experts and me researching the Greek Olympics. First, we will look up where are we looking, and what are we looking for, and what do we need to bring. For an example of what we could be researching is where do they practice. Maybe in farmlands they practice, and probably they um, practice to worship their gods, such as Zeus and Poseidon. The second step is the excavation process, which is going to be presented by David. Before you start today, you need to make sure of a couple things. You need to have a permit to dig at your site, the site you choose. Also need to make sure that the site you are digging is safe. Safety is the most important thing. You should always watch out for pipes, animals, and sometimes even bombs or battle sites. Then you should then you should make a grid of what you have found. As you can see, my colleagues have already found some artifacts. Sander, what have you found? I found some ancient weights. They could have been used in the ancient games. Okay. The third step is the analysis of findings. Today, Cora is going to present this step. Analysis of findings is the third is step of the archaeological method. In this step, every hour I spend during the excavation process, we will carefully spend 10 hours in the lab analyzing artifacts. We also need to ask ourselves more important questions. If you do not answer these questions, you will mess up your analyzing of findings. These questions are, what is presented by Ryan. In this step, when the archaeologist has completed analyzing the findings, the culture reporter must document them and publicize the findings with the world. Right here I have a horse saddle. There are multiple ways to publicize <laughs> our finding. You could make models, posters, and even articles. When you are publicizing, always remember to have an image and a description of what the artifact is. The fifth step is preservation presented by Will. During this step, you must preserve your findings. You should do this because in the future, technology changes and gets better. Considering this, there may be answers in the future. Preservation is a very important step to the archaeological method.